Oh, we hate each other. We We're hate enemies. each other. We are enemies. Uh, it's finished. Two all at Stamford Bridge. Chelsea two, Liverpool two. Overall, it's a good point for both teams, but the real winners are Manchester City. Not a good point for both teams. I mean, it's a good point. It's a good point for Liverpool in as much as coming to Stamford Bridge isn't easy. It's a good point for Chelsea in as much as we were two 0 down. We've had a terrible week, into, well, terrible forty eight hours in terms of the build up to this game. So getting a point is a fairly positive result. This was such an intense game. It reminded me of like. Um, sort of previous seasons gone by when both teams decided to get into it. It wasn't that defensive, cagey stuff that we mm. remember from Mourinho and Benitez. This is open, get out there and attack, be the better team. Chelsea were the better team today in my mind. I, I think, I, and I mean that marginally, mm. but I do mean you have more control of the game. You, got, you guys seem to have a better idea of where to cut Liverpool off. And actually Liverpool are fairly fortunate. We went out there to cause chaos. Caused some chaos, but not enough for three goals. There is one for you. Do you think it was a sending off for Sadio Mane after about 15 seconds? Should he have gone off there? Uh, you, it's tricky because if you look at the angle, every angle from the wide, I'm like, ah, he's just put his hand across. But then there's one where you sort of see him sort of screw the eye mm. a little bit. And that made me think, could be a sending off. But if that was the case, you get, do you get carded for the attempt or the actual execution? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Because in that case, then you could also make an argument that Mount should get sent off yeah. just for the thought yeah, and yeah. sort of swing through. Oh, of course, yeah. But I still think you're right. You, in that game, you could have said Mount doesn't get sent off, he gets a yellow. Sadio Mane gets the red early on for doing something stupid. Mm. And there you go. It's difficult. You know the difficult uh, thing is, if that happens 57 minutes in, do VAR feel a bit more comfortable sort of going, let's take a minute on this? Yeah. Look yeah, the little screw. There's another angle we can get, or whatever. Do you think? Yeah, I think I think sending somebody off so early, I think you can get away with things Probably. quite as early as that. Probably, but but overall, I think it I think it was as yellow as a yellow card can be. Sure, like on the spectrum of a yellow card, I think it was a, a definite yellow, bright yellow. Probably not a sending off. Okay, and so I get that. I think that was I Great think that was good. I thought Mohamed Salah's goal was ridiculous, absolutely ridiculous. Marcus Alonso is still looking for him. The way that he Great dropped the shoulder. As well. Yeah, it's a clever ball over, was it? Alexander Arnold. Both of both Liverpool and um, and and Chelsea look for the gap in between the defender and the fullback. Yeah. Well, you got a goal from yeah, yeah you got a goal from Matt, yeah. Ran through, and we got a yeah. goal on the on the opposite side. So mm -hmm. I think overall, there you've got um, you see where the Premier League sort of they you you have all these runners going in between those gaps, and in the end you. Breakthrough. Do you know? Do you know what? When I think about that Pulisic goal, look, it was a great goal the way he took it. It was. But I'm already thinking about the miss. You know when he got put through? When he got put through, I think the, the mistake would have been Alexander Arnold's. And yeah, Pulisic couldn't have asked for a better chance. Well, he just sort of. Well, Keller had did very well. And then Liverpool at the other end capitalised on that, and it literally minutes later, yes. Sadio Mane puts it in. So yeah. it would have been one all at that point. Yeah, it was a completely different moment, wasn't it? I mean, Sadio Mane. The way, look, Sadio Mane was on a goal drought as well. The way that he took that goal was very impressive. Mm -hmm. um, Kelleher, by the way, very impressive understudy. He's, he's conceded a goal that I don't think many goalkeepers would save from um, Kovacic. Kovacic. Oh. Kovacic's much, man of the match for me. Yeah, Kovacic, right? Kovacic's yeah, he was actually, wasn't he? Kovacic's yeah, yeah, yeah I agree with that. And then I think the other side of that is the, the Pulisic goal. Just such a weird strike. It sort of went over him, about mm. there. That's kind of a hard area to yeah. keep. I think he, he hit it early, Pulisic, as well, which was so hard. hard. Yeah. yeah. So it was a really, I think he actually, apart from that, had a pretty decent commanding performance. Yeah. I, I know he looks small, but he's... He's a good he's keeper. Very yeah. good against Leicester in the cup as well. Good but, understudy. But look, we are now, look, that's what happened. Chelsea. Chelsea and Liverpool have drawn two all. It's over, isn't it? No. Really? No. Are you one of them? I love it. I need Be you in my life because I, I, I that's don't why I'm here. this. That's why I'm here. Do you believe, do you still believe in uh, life yeah. after love? Yeah. Yes. The, the reason I do share is because I think um, that we saw the weak underbelly of City the other day uh, against Arsenal. You saw what you need to do. Liverpool still have to play them. Uh, there, there's still other teams that could be tricky. The only difference is with City, they, they can spread things out enough. The, game, the difficult games are spread out enough that you sort of go... OK, they might get through that one and then they'll have Brentford and a couple of others Does it and not that'll challenge them a little though? bit. Does it not trouble you that they've already been to Anfield, been to Stamford Bridge, yeah. been to Tottenham, they've been everywhere where they could drop points? Liverpool went away and levelled the playing field against Chelsea today with late, uh, late people going out of Matip, Firmino and Alisson. Mm. You'd argue two of those guys could have changed the game today. Yeah. So I think we, are, we, we will see other teams frustrate City. It's just... 
I'd rather it was closer mm. than a runaway title. Yeah, we could have really... done with Arsenal getting something yesterday, couldn't we? They almost did. They should have. They should have won, did. let alone drew. It, I know. I actually think Arsenal will feel like they were aggrieved yesterday, not City. City didn't play the better football. Arsenal did. Yeah. We're seeing Arsenal build on that now. So you think there's a world in which either Chelsea or Liverpool can still win the league? Can put pressure on them. Okay. Well, to make I... it interesting. That'll make it interesting. And then we're watching the games. There's a bit of pressure on City. What happened mm. there? Well, I, loved, I love that theory, and I'm, that's what I'm going to get on board with. What do you think, Loz, to the significance of this result on the Romelu Lukaku affair? I don't know how much we can assume because also he's had those comments to Tim Howard where he says, I'll be able to make more, cl- there'll be more clarity around this, so there'll be more comments. So it makes me think there's something else or this guy's played a terrible hand and he's trying to make it look like he's got something really smart to come. And but he's a clever dude. Do you feel like, do you feel like we're underestimating him thinking that he hasn't got something up his sleeve? Like this must all be calculated. I don't know what he would have. There must be something that is a, feels like a smoking gun in order to go... Right. What's he been saying to Tim Howard? That's what I need to know. What's Tim, yeah, and, and what's, what's Tuchel been saying to Lukaku to make him go, I'm miserable here? So, because so, Tuchel's relationship, by the way, with him is clearly deteriorated mm. to a degree where he feels, I need to go and speak about this guy. Tuchel's had this before with other players where he's, he's clearly pissed someone off or something mm. like that. Does this too all have an impact? Does this too all have any kind of impact I think on, on that issue? I think the way the players played with that level of energy today is pretty fascinating. Mm. Is that you? Yeah, I just wonder, do you, I just wonder if Chelsea had played Lukaku or had, a, had Lukaku available today without any of the context. Yeah. What would have happened? Would it have been a different story or are Chelsea actually a very functional team, a team that won the European Cup without him? What would Lukaku, if you're Lukaku watching that game, yeah. Chelsea have put in a performance that you don't want because that performance has proved that the players are completely backing Tuchel, I think. Well, well, but not only that, I mean, the, the problem is if you're Lukaku and you're looking for a move somewhere else, the players might go, fair play to you, but I've got to go play for my contract here or mm. I've got to go do this. You can still support your teammate and might be he, that might see that he's pissed off with something, but it, you can still go, well, I'm, I've got to play for Chelsea. Mm. It, it would be very unusual, I think, to accuse a player of such unprofessionalism. They basically go, my mate's a bit sad, so I might yeah. not play well today. Yeah. Well, look, that's two, so that's two all. That's the last time that we'll play each other unless we meet in the cup. Or we might maybe do. even in St. Petersburg. I would love for you and I to go to St. Petersburg. I would love that. I mean, I'd love that for football, but I'd just love that anyway. Yeah, good Just point. you and I. The, the beautiful other, bridge there. I, it, the other thing is, I think between the two of us, I also think um, when it comes down to it, City have improved in such minor ways this season across the pitch that they don't need that striker right now. There are other areas mm. where you see that I think they, that they are attackable and people are going to work that out in the second half of the season. I love your optimism. I sadly don't agree, but Loz, I need to hear it. We'll see. Because the way I feel is it's a done, it's a it's done, it's in the bag. Man City have won the league. It's but I am awesome. delighted, I'm delighted that you say that because it keeps me slightly believing. We lose our players to AFCON now. Mm. I'm going to be so fascinated to see what Minamino and oh Firmino and Jota. That's Mate, a we're going to have right Pepper Ariza Balagering off. So uh, that's part of it. Yeah. So we have we have issues. But all to you. Thank you so much for watching this video. We are so grateful. I'm really, really Happy delighted. New Year. Happy New Year. Yeah. I will see you on the other side. Please like, please comment, and remember, go easy, step lightly, and stay free. Salah.